Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel here at uh, uh, Crypto Nation. Please, if you're new here, it's totally free. Go ahead and subscribe and hit the like button for post notifications. It is totally free. But anyways, let's get right into it. So, yeah, a lot of cryptos are um, still red. Um, yeah, there's a lot of yeah, cryptos out there that are um, still down. But um, as you can see, Uma's right here is still up. This coin is doing really good. Like I said, I recently picked up about 110. I bought between like five and six dollars, and the chart looks really good. I talked about this the uh, the other yesterday, and uh, yeah, there's uh, Bitcoin is now trading. Oh, okay, it was just over forty thousand. Now it's back under forty. It looks like Bitcoin is, is holding support between thirty nine and forty thousand as of right now. Uh, there's Ethereum. Here's everything in the snapshot. Ethereum is, out, is still at 20, little, just over 2200, 2235. Here's all your tops. There's Solana. Solana's at 86. It looked like Solana came back, came up a little bit. It, Solana went all the way down to like 80. Now I was, I was actually starting to think Solana was going to dip down into the 70s. And I was, it looked like Solana's trying to uh, come back. 86 dollars right now. Those XRP, XRP is at 51.6. XRP is not really moving. Really, it's actually down 9 percent in the seven day. Last 24 hours is down over 2%. Uh, the one hour up 0.56. But Solana is just pretty moving like a snail. It's not moving too much. Um, I guess a lot every a lot of people who's holding XRP, hey, this is an opportunity to, to, to keep, you know, adding your bags. Everybody who's in XRP, the market cap is at $28 billion. Um, Yep. All righty. There's Polkadot at 635 polka dot their market cap is at eight eight billion market cap all right there's chain leak their market cap is, is just at eight little oh just over eight billion at fourteen dollars there's there's internet computer at 1070 market cap at four billion I'm telling you there's it's only going to be a matter of time before um before um internet computer flip you know flip these other projects it's only going to be a matter of time but yeah there's your top cryptos Right there, immutable X, Filecoin, market cap is at two billion. Yep, there's all your favorite cryptos. There's Say, 1.5 billion market cap for Say coin. Yep, all your favorite altcoins, all your favorite cryptos. All here, Beam. Market, oh wow, Beam market cap is only at eight. 867 uh, million just under a billion market cap and it's only at the price is at one cent but unfortunately you can't get it on coinbase that is a good price it is down 20 something percent in them in a seven day who that's a good price right there and the price is only at one just over one cent for beam hmm uh but anyways uh, anyways, in this uh, video, I want to talk about um, no other than Bunk, Bunk Coin. Look like Bunk Coin is trying to climb back up. Right now, Bunk Coin is at um, and we it went it gained a, it gained another uh, zero. It was at uh, it was at five zeros nine. Now it's back up to you know four zeros ten. Uh, it's still down forty two percent in the one month. Uh, the seven day is down twenty percent, but the one day it actually went up a little bit today. Bunk coin, there's a market cap, 690 million market cap. So your bunk coin, there's gonna be there's still a lot of growth for this coin. I, be, I believe this coin once Solana start pumping again, uh bunk coin is gonna is gonna pump right along with it. I, I don't know. I just feel there's a uh a lot of people, you know, thought that after bunk hit the major exchanges that it was it was pretty much done, but that's not true. Of course it pulled back. The pullback that it that it did after it hit the exchanges like Coinbase and Binance or crypto.com, whatever that was natural. That was just a that was a normal pullback. You know, it went it went down about 50 something percent in a month. So I took advantage of that. Right now I'm holding up, I'm holding about 110 million bonks. So I'm holding a pretty nice bag of bonk. And I only need this thing to hit lose one or two zeros. In a bull run, bonk lose at least one or two more zeros in a bull run. Hey, I'll be I'll be happy with that. You know, if if bonk pumps the point. Uh, the two zeros ten or ten percent of a penny, I'll be up a nice bag if it if it gets up to even even two zeros three zeros nine. 
the amount of bunk that I'm holding, even if uh, in the bull run in 2024, if it just get the three zeros nine or three zeros eight, I'll be up a pretty nice bag. But I believe in the bull run. I believe that it's going to at least lose about two more zeros. And you do not want to miss that. Like I said, if you do the math, man, the more the better. Uh, let me see. I'm holding. Let me go to calculator right quick just to show you guys what I'm talking about here. For those of you who probably maybe, I don't know, new to cryptocurrency, show you how much money you can make by just putting up a little bit of money. Hold on just one second. Uh, okay. All right, there we have it. That's 110 million right there. And that's how much bunk that I'm holding. So right now, bunk is at what, four zeros? Just, just, you know, about four zeros, 10 or something like that. So you multiply that times, let's say we just lose... Let's say the bull run bunk coin gets to like two zeros, 10 or 10 percent, just our 10 percent of a penny. All right. That's 10 percent of a penny right there. Right. Our two zeros one. That's that's one hundred and ten thousand dollars right there. Just lose, you know, lose to, you know, two zeros. So let's say if bunk coin, um, it just lose. Just uh, let's say it just lose one zero. So point zero, let's say it gets up to like three zeros, like um, let's say it just go, goes to three zeros, eight, three zeros, eight and holding one hundred and ten million bunk. That's eighty eight thousand dollars, guys. That's a nice bag right there. That's a pretty nice bag right there. If we lose just just lose one zero. And go to like three zeros, like eight or nine or whatever. But I believe that in the bull run, I believe that that bull coin can possibly get up to fit, get up to um, two zeros five or fifty percent of a penny in the bull run. But let's just see here. Anything is possible in this market times point zero zero five. That's fifty percent of a penny. So if it, let's say let's say if it gets up to fifty percent of a penny or two zeros five. That's five hundred and fifty thousand dollars. That's a nice bag right there. Five hundred and fifty thousand. And by the end of twenty twenty four, if it, if if bond coin gets up to pumps up to like fifty percent of a penny, and, and, like I said, my goal eventually, I think I'm gonna get up to two hundred million bond. The more the better, you know. I'm gonna eventually get up to two hundred million bond. You know, my goal was really a hundred million, but I decided I'm gonna go ahead and get more bond because I I see the um the big opportunity in this with bond coin. You know, like I said, I believe it's going to at least lose at least another two zeros in a bull run. But yeah, because that's, that's how much bunk I'm holding as of right now. But anyways, guys, uh, let's take a look at the volume. The volume is at positive 23 percent. Uh, of course, the tokenomics the same. It's not changing. Uh, you know, uh, what's that? A hundred, a hundred. Um, what's that? Hundred and twenty A hundred trillion in the max supply, and then we got ninety-three trillion in the total supply. And the um, yeah, the total supply. Then we got sixty-three trillion in the uh, circulating supply, which is sixty-three percent of the um, of the circulation. So yeah, bulk coin, man. I believe this is this could definitely lose at least one or two more zeros in the bull run. I, like I said, I'm looking at the market cap. I believe in the bull run, this can definitely hit about fifteen or twenty billion in the market cap. 15 to 20 billion market cap and you you look at the market cap for bond coin it's not even at a billion market cap yet guys so yeah we're sitting at 691 million <laughs> market cap so we're there's there's still a lot of upside for bond coin and I, I earlier earlier today i looked at the um ether scan it's only about i think it's only about 10,000 wallet holders or something like that but but that's constantly going up uh as far as the wallet holders actually let me check ether scan I think it was check ether scan. I think it was something the wallet holders. Let me see bonk. There it is. Okay, nine thousand wallet holders. Nine thousand wallet holders. It looked like it just went down just a little bit. This shows that people, more people probably sold, but yeah, there's a wallet holders. Just over just over nine thousand. Uh, so there it is. Uh, take a look at the Dex trades. 
it says the total supply 503 trillion huh okay fully diluted fully diluted market cap circulating supply market cap and fully diluted market okay it says the fully diluted market cap is 5 billion Ooh, look at that I'm looking at the Dex trades. Look at this. It looked like more people are buying bulk. I'm, you know, taking a look at these Dex trades. It definitely looked like there's more buyers and sellers. You know, people who who picked it up at 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 five zeros nine. I, I think I bought a little bit more five zeros nine as well because I bought like about four or five different times to get me up to like a hundred and ten million bunk. And like I said, I'm eventually gonna. My goal is to get up to about two hundred million bunk. I believe that once I get up to at least about 200 million bunk, I think I'm going to be set. I'm already set with 110 million, but I don't know. I just want to go ahead and get 200 million bunk. Yeah, I think I want to go ahead and get to 200 million. Because uh, I believe that in the bull run, this is going to make me a nice, some nice, some you know, this is going to make me a big bag in the bull run. Because I highly believe that that bunk coin, look, oh, look at all these buys right here. Buy, buy, buy. More people is clearly buying bunk. Look at that. Look, look at the Dex trade history. Look at that. Of course, you're always going to get sellers, but it looks good when you got a, you know more buyers. Look at that. Buy, 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 buy. Look at that. And I know I've been buying bunk for the last like week. <laughs> you know to get me up to 110 uh, uh, million. Like I said in the bull run, I only need this to lose maybe two zeros if this lose two zeros now can bunk pump to a penny in a bull run anything is possible in this in this in this market uh i don't know what kind of burn mechanism they're going to use if, if bunk coin can get up to a penny they're going to have to do some burning they're going to have to start burning like the the supply if i believe they get up to that price but honestly but to be more realistic i think that bunk coin can at least like i said lose two zeros in a bull run maybe it can get up to 50 percent of a penny even if it just gets to like maybe 10% of a penny or even 309 if it pumps to like 309 you know which is like right before 10% of a penny that'll be good eight or you know 3089 that'll be really good especially if you're holding you know 200 million bunk tokens you'll you'll be set and and another thing is I I think it's going to do good is because it's like I said it's connected to Solana the fact that we know we all know that Solana coin is going to do good in the bull run right we all know that Solana is going to do good in the bull run Solana in the bull run is suspected to possibly go up to like a it could possibly they're saying that it, by the end of 2024 going into 25 Solana could possibly be at a between 800 to a thousand dollars a coin so so I definitely believe that uh bulk coin if Solana get go between 800 to a thousand a coin by the end of 2024 what do you guys think that what bond coin could be at bond coin could be at two zeros it can it can lose two more zeros definitely you know, right now we got, let me see, yeah, one, two, three, four zeros. So, yeah, guys, that's my take on Bonk. Tell me what you think. Anybody here in Bonk or what, or what uh, meme coin do you have in your portfolio? I think, you know, uh, safe to say going forward in this bull run, I believe it is good. Not financial advice, but I believe it's good to have at least one meme coin in your portfolio because we know what meme coins can do. You know, they can be unpredictable. And but you can make a I would just watch this coin call. There's some there's a meme coin called Chow Chow that literally pumped over it pumped over 16 or 1700 percent today. Some uh, some meme coin called Chow Chow. Crazy. I don't know. I don't know if it's a Solana meme coin or, or Ethereum meme coin, but this thing went crazy. <laughs> but shouts out there. Anybody who got in this play, it went it traded sideways for a long time, but it just recently did a massive pump. But I highly believe that bond coin, like I said, the. The bond coin um, parabolic run is not over. Of, of course, it slowed down, which was expected after it hit the major changes. You know, a lot of people was already up a lot of money, but that was the first phase of, of the um, of the pump because it looked like bond coin started off with six zeros. That was at four. It already lost two zeros, but now going towards in a bull run, like I said, over, I believe it can lose another two zeros. Hey, it can probably lose three zeros. Well, let's say, let's say if it lose three zeros, you know, well, obviously, if it loses three zeros, that means that it's going to get up, get up to a penny, obviously. But let's see. But like I said, it could, this is definitely can lose two zeros in the bull run. But yeah, that's my take. Thanks, everybody, for tuning in. Tell me what you think. Go ahead and subscribe and hit the like button. 
what post notifications. Just hope the algorithm get out there. And hope everybody enjoy the rest of your uh, Tuesday night. And I'm going to go ahead and get some rest. Hey, y'all take it easy. Bye-bye.